A little while ago, right, I was got home and there was a post office card that had come from my door saying there was a parcel down the post office, right? It's got my car, shot down there, right? Give the bloke the card and he looked at me and he went, you got any? You all right? <laughs> I fucking love that. Have you got any ID, right? And I went, no, I haven't, mate. And he went, you need ID for the parcel. And I was like, well, be honest, your pal, the parcel I'm picking up has actually got my passport in. So, if you undo the parcel, you will see my passport, you'll know it's me, then you can give me the parcel, right? And he looked at me and went, sorry, mate, rules are rules. Rules are rules. So I lost my shit big time. <laughs> First of all, I'll give it the old, uh, not being funny, mate, but it's quite a journey home and back. Let me tell you something now. If you ever try to blag someone about how long it is to get home and back, don't do it in the fucking post office, mate. <laughs> He's like, you're about five minutes off, you dickhead. I was like, all right, pal. All right. So I lost it big time with him. I said, really? Are you telling me now that I have just broken into someone's house Walked around, looked at the telly, the jewellery, the DVD collection, all the money, and looked at the doorstep near the letterbox and thought, fuck it, I'm going to nick the post office card. <laughs> I said to him, we might as well have a game show called Shit or Bust. <laughs> yeah. And I'm there like that. Right, Clayton, you've acquired all these prizes. Do you want to go for the post office card? <laughs> and all the crowd, you shout out card now, shout it. Card, 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 card. card, card. card. Fuck it, I'm going to go for the card. <laughs> oh. And I run down the post office like that and I give it to him. And he's like, all right, all right, calm down, Clay. Please, everyone, calm down. Calm down. <sighs> Are you all right? Yeah, I'm all right. I've run a bit far, but I'm all right. <laughs> right, what you got to do now? I'm going to ask you one simple question, Clay. Just give me the card. I'll give him the card. One question and one question only. For the star prize. It's behind the post office card. And I'm like, all right, I'm ready for it. Go on. And he's like, what's the name on the post office slip that you give me? <laughs> you know, like in game shows, when you stand there thinking it over. Fucking hell, I didn't even look. <laughs> You know, and you like, you know, you know, they think it through. They're like, think of a proper British name. Proper British name. <laughs> right, I'm ready. All right, go on then. Dave Patel. <laughs> and he'd be like, oh, unlucky pal. And you'd be like, oh, you're joking. He said, unfortunately, you've lost all the prizes that you've acquired and the star prize. You know what the star prize is? We've got to tell you just to piss you off a little bit more. Like, what is it? Two weeks, all inclusive to Jamaica for all your family. Oh, always wanted to go to Jamaica, but don't worry, Clayton. You won't go away empty handed. You got a two year prison sentence for burglary. <laughs> <laughs> and everyone's cheering, and I'm like, this isn't good. And he's like, Do you want to know what the answer was? And I'll be like, Yes, please. The answer on the card was. Clayton Jones. And I'll be like, yeah, yeah, but that's me. I'm Clayton Jones. And he'd be like, have you got any ID? And I'd be like, Do you know what I mean? Anyway, did all this. A couple of grannies behind me loved that shit. They were like, yeah, mate, go for it. Do you know what I mean? The bloke at the post office just looked at me and went, wow. I tell you what I'm going to do, pal, because you've done a lot of running around and a couple of the old grannies are a little bit hyper. I'm going to go and get your parcel for you, right? And he walked off, and then he come back to the front of the desk and stood there like this. <laughs> oh, dearie, dearie me. And I was like, what's up, pal? He went, uh, the card you've given me, the parcel's not here. <laughs> so I said, say that again, pal. I think you find the parcel is here. He said, no, it's not, because the card you give me, if you'd have read it, Tells you that the parcel's been given to your next door neighbour. <laughs> now, 
I don't like to be one of them guys that loses out on shit. So I just went, well, postman Pat. Did my next door neighbour have to give his ID when he took the parcel? And now I'm fucking barred from the post office. 